we got a lot of cool characters, Beyblades, and gimmicks for those Beyblades. But did you ever wonder just how big the Beyblade stadiums are? While Takarotami and Hasbro have given us this, we want something that looks more like this. You're watching Beyblade Dad and today we're finding out how big is an anime Beyblade stadium. So here we go. First things first, let's set some ground rules. We're going to do Beyblade Burst stadiums and we're basically going to use what we have for information on the anime itself. We're not going to use the manga because let's face it, not everybody reads it. We do have quite a few stadiums to go through. So let's get right into that and begin with the first stadium that we do see in Beyblade Burst. Well, luckily enough, we do get a lot of glimpses as to how big this Beyblade stadium is. And for the most part, this size Beyblade stadium is what they use throughout the tournaments and throughout most of their practices in every single season. So when we're looking at a round Beyblade stadium, this is how big it actually is. To first find out how big it is, we have to do some measuring. And this is not something that's hard to do. And that's because we can reference off one of the characters themselves that we have and see how big they are compared to the Beyblade stadiums and then we have our result. We're gonna use Volta Oi as a reference point or as a measuring stick. So we'll have something to compare it to. Now, I did try to look up just how tall Volta Oi is, but of course, I could not find that information anywhere. So what I did do is take the average height of an 11 year old because well, that's how old Vault is throughout the Beyblade Burst first season. If you're a big fan of the Beyblade series as well, you can actually notice and compare with another more standard feature that we would find in the real world and that is a barn door. There is in the first episode of Beyblade Burst Turbo a scene in which Iger rolls the Beyblade Stadium across a barn door giving us the overall length of the Beyblade Stadium not necessarily the diameter that we're looking for. So in order to make life a lot easier for myself and for this video, I decided to actually reference off every single main character. So hey, here's a freebie for you. Let's see everybody's height compared to Vault. And in doing so, I could find out from various different locations and pictures just how big each stadium is. I'm going to quickly show you the process of just how I came up with all of the measurements for the stadiums. You might be asking yourself, well, what's the point? Why do I even want to know the anime stadium sizes? It is my hope to one day see these anime stadiums come to light. And now, by having the exact measurements, or at least what I think is the right measurements, giving us a chance to accurately know just how big they are in real life and giving us a chance to replicate them, not only as a hobby, but perhaps for tournament standardization. It would be amazing to see schools and parks fitted with these Beyblade stadiums that are basically true to the show. But I digress. Now that we have all the information that we need, that is the height of our bladers, now we can compare it to, like I said, all of the stadiums we have. When we're thinking about how big they are, I'm going to talk about the diameter of the dome itself. So when we start off in first, the diameter of that stadium is 6 feet and 10 inches, which is huge when you think about it. And you could really see that and you can tell just by looking at the anime, just the sheer size of it. But the Beyblade Burst Sparking or Beyblade Burst Surge Stadium is even bigger than that, coming in at 8 feet 8 inches or 2.5 meters, a little bit more than two and a half meters in diameter. A Beyblade Stadium that actually surprised me with its size was the Championship Stadium that was used between Dante and Gwyn in the finals for Beyblade Burst Rise, otherwise made by Hasbro into the Vertical Drop Battle Set, which is nine feet in diameter. Following the trend of being bigger, the Dynamite Battle Stadium is one of the biggest ones we have. No doubt, as you've seen with Dynamite Battle set that was introduced this year in 2021, its diameter is 9.5 feet, but that's still smaller than another Beyblade Stadium I have not yet mentioned. And that is of course the Hypersphere. 
the hypersphere is two stadiums together in my opinion or two domes squished together now the length of this is 11 feet and 7 inches making it a real hassle to ever carry around this Beyblade stadium along with the rails of the turbo Beyblade stadium are among the biggest that we have. The Beyblade Burst Turbo Rails are actually 10 and a half feet in diameter from end to end. These Beyblade Stadiums, while amazing, they must be situated in basically one spot. Just the sheer size of them means that they will be heavy. But how do we explain that Iger was able to roll his Beyblade Stadium? Maybe that stadium was made with a different material. But what are Beyblade Stadiums? made out of is it foam is it concrete or is it something else all together subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss the next beyblade theory from this beyblade dad